today we're going to do some demonstrations for you of our piloted parking technology. The first feature that we will demonstrate for you is our parking lot function. Imagine you just got off an airplane after a long day of traveling across country. You grab your luggage and you head out to your car. You're so excited to get home and finally get some rest. Only to find when you approach your car that it's wedged in between two other vehicles and there's no possible way to get into your car. Well, we have an answer to that. Simply take out your smartphone, open up an app. As soon as you open that app, it'll send a signal to the vehicle. The ignition will start. You'll simply press a button on your phone that says drive. As he's pressing that button, that car is pulling out of that spot for him. It's using ultrasonic sensors to do this. It has securely pulled <laughs> itself out of that tight parking spot. Now you can easily get into the vehicle, push your luggage in the back seat of the car, and be on your way home, just with a touch of the button on your smartphone. The next feature that we will show you is also a parking lot function. I think we can all agree that there is nothing more frustrating than driving in circles, desperately trying to find a parking spot. Well, simple for us, because all we have to do is enable a parking mode. You press a button on the center console of the vehicle. And once that button is pressed, the ultrasonic sensors on the vehicle, which are located on the front fenders, the rear fenders, and all four corners of the vehicle next to the tires, there's a circular sensor that will send out the signal and detect for you any vacant parking structure in your vicinity. It will send directions to your vehicle take you to that structure, find an empty spot for you. Not only will it find an empty spot for you, it will make sure that that spot's dimensions are large enough for your car to fit in. Once the car has found that spot for you, you simply get out of the car, make sure the parking bars, parking brake is engaged, uh, the electric parking brake is on, and you take out your smartphone, you simply hit that app, you're just holding down a button that says drive. As you hold down that button, that car begins to drive itself into that spot. When you see the wheels turning on the car, it's not something that he's doing with the phone. It's not like a video game where you're steering it into its spot. The ultrasonic sensors are doing that for him. He's simply supervising it as the car is pulling into that spot. For any reason, if you needed to stop the vehicle, you would simply take your button, your finger off the button on the smartphone as well as anything that came into the path of the vehicle, the sensors would note that and stop on its own. That's just a safety feature that we have as well while you're supervising it, that if you wanted to stop it, just take your finger off that button. These ultrasonic sensors are continuing to measure the exact distance that it needs to fit the best way possible between those two cars. He's just continuing to hold down that button once that car is securely parked, the lights will turn off, the engine will turn off, the doors will lock, and you can simply walk away. That was all with just a press of a button. It found you a parking spot in a congested city. The next feature we are going to show you is called Garage Park. When you pull in front of your house, in front of your garage when you get home, again, you'll just enable that parking mode, which is located on the center console of the car next to the steering wheel. You make sure that the parking brake is on and the car is in park. You step out of the car, take out that smartphone, open your app with one swipe of the finger. Once that signal is sent, the garage will detect that and slowly start to open. We are using a laser sensor for this technology. You can see the laser sensor here on the red A6. It is a rectangle that's located in the lower part of the grille of the car under the Audi Tooth and Engineering sign. That's the laser sensor. That is in the front of that car being used to send a signal to measure where the car needs to go to safely fit in that garage. He's just holding down that drive button as the car pulls in the garage for him. You'll notice that when the car comes to a complete stop, the lights blink three times. That's to signify to you that it's fully parked, the engine is off, the lights will go off and the garage door will come down. The final demonstration we have is getting your car out of the garage. Again, you'll just walk to the garage, take out your smartphone, 
Open that app on your phone with one swipe of the finger. Signal will be sent. You'll see that the garage door will slowly come up. First thing you'll notice that the lights will go on on the vehicle. Once the garage gets to a safe height, the engine will start on the car. He's just holding down the button on his phone. Slowly the, go the car will start to back out of the garage for you. And again, if he wanted the car to stop for any reason, his kid came out to maybe tell him something, he said, what? You just take your finger off and it'll stop. You'll notice again the three lights, the tail lights will blink three times, which will tell you that the car is now safe for you to enter. The doors will unlock. And you're able to hop in the car. The garage door will close. And that was all done with your smartphone. And I'm sure you're wondering what type of equipment we have here that is doing all this magic. Well, it's not like we've seen before when the whole trunk was full of PCs and heavy equipment. Now, it's compact, streamlined, fit into the trunk here. It is the size of an iPad. It is called the ZFAS, Z-F-A-S. It's a computer system that Audi has developed to do all of our piloted parking technology. We have a full scale model here, so you can see exactly the size of it. It's about the size of an iPad. You can lift it with one hand. So this is making it production ready, whereas in the past, with all that heavy equipment, it simply wouldn't be practical. This is something that Audi has developed and streamlined in less than one year's time. We're looking about five years from now for this to be production. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed our demonstration today of the piloted parking technology. Thank you for coming by. Please enjoy your rest of the day here at CES.